you know, should be out. Everybody should be okay in a couple of days. Yeah. How y'all doing? Oh, doing all right. It snowed a little bit last night, so I enjoyed that. Yeah, oh, I, I used to love it in New Mexico. Yeah. Man, no. it, it snow didn't bother me at all. No, <laughs> I like it. We don't get it very often, but where Sister lives, I think there is a pretty steady thing in the winter. Yeah, well, I, uh, you know, all of this and everything, I, if, if I've got this right, now a whole lot of this is... Uh, you know, I don't know. It just there's a whole bunch I don't remember, obviously. Mm. But uh, we came in on the 18th. They called us. I don't know, 5:30 or 6 maybe. And uh, they begin surgery. If, 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 if I've got this right, about three o'clock in the morning of the 19th. Mm. And the first day that I remember anybody coherently was the 27th because that's my anniversary no and uh prissy came in and she leaned over and, and she kissed me and she said uh, asked me if i knew who she was and i said well yeah and she said well, you know today's our anniversary and so i was out for lord have mercy uh, mm. a couple of weeks or uh, over a week yeah and um the uh, slowly but surely everything started to come back into place you know for a long time i didn't have any taste buds uh, mm. i was and I've, I've learned about a new disease it's the only one that our family hasn't had uh, but it's called icu psychosis okay and what it is it's a result of massive trauma to your body mm. and the effects of uh, uh anesthesia and and then to be loaded up on all these various uh, medications Mm -hmm. these, these enormous amounts of medication and it causes you just to be loony you, mm -hmm. know? you don't know who you're seeing you don't know who you're talking to you don't know what they're saying to you and mm -hmm. so you have all these wild dreams and these wild hallucinations, hallucinations mm -hmm. of, of what's been going on and that started to I don't want to come back there. Yeah. Uh, I, 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 I'm going to take care of myself because I ain't going back through this. No. This is too weird. Yeah, well. But it was, you know, everything has been, I saw one of the, the, well, the chief surgeon I saw today, and he told me that everything that, that they're reading daily in the blood tests that they do, everything is falling exactly perfect into place. Well, that's great. So music, uh, music. Uh, medically, uh, everything is fine. Now, I'm, I'm in uh, rehab, and they're working with me on, on muscles and st stuff, but I get a little better with that every day. Well, good. So they're looking. They hope to have me out of here Friday. Oh, that right would now. be. So, uh, you know, but uh, I, I tell you what, it's a... Uh, it's been a, it's been, it's been interesting. I've never, you know, I, I'm, and, and I'm the most grateful person in the world, you know, because there's a, there's a family, because there was a donor, there's mm -hmm. a family out there that lost somebody. Mm -hmm. And, um, uh, uh, they, they'll, you know, they let you deal with that. I don't know how they do it, but that's later. Yeah. And, um, so I, I feel real fortunate. I'm, I, I make no bones about it. Well, but, uh, you know, and uh, it's it's the whole. You know, my life has definitely changed. Uh, one of the sacrifices you've got to make when you do this is that you become a diabetic. Mm. And uh, I, I can live with that. My wife's a diabetic. Yeah. Uh, grandma was a diabetic. Yes, yeah, sister and teen both. So so I mean, I've got to get used to eating that way. Yeah. You know how Daddy was all our life. We eat fried fish and fried squirrel over. Yeah. You know, just thick blue smoke hung over the roof of the house <laughs> for, for 20 years, you know. Yeah. You know, grease falling off of everything. Yeah. And, uh, I can't do that anymore. But Well, it's healthy. It's just healthy eating, I think. Well, it is. I mean, there's no reason to eat like that. Yeah. The only person that can eat like that and stay healthy is Dad. Yeah. Nobody else can. <laughs> but, you know, his cholesterol would kill normal people. Mm. So, uh, 
you know, I'd already made up my mind that I wanted to change up my eating habits. Yeah. So I don't consider that really a sacrifice. No, that's what we Everybody all need. Everybody figures out how they can eat exactly what they want every day. Then I want to know how what that secret is. Yeah, really. Because uh, I don't think that's the way it's supposed to be. No. <laughs> so I don't feel, you know, I feel very fortunate. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm feeling as good as a person can can physically feel under the circumstances. Mm -hmm. And I have no complaints. Well, that's wonderful. I'm very grateful to, uh, uh, you know, I'm grateful to that family. I'm grateful to the skill of the surgeons mm -hmm. because, let me tell you what, that's some cutting-edge medicine. Mm -hmm. That's some people that know what they're doing. Yeah. Uh, the surgery was uh, over 11 hours. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, that whole team stayed there. You know, everybody was in there for 11 hours mm -hmm. doing as intense surgery as you could probably possibly do. Yeah. And uh, for me to feel as good as I feel, you know, this much time later. Hi, dear. Come on in. Yeah, but come on in. Sorry. Yeah, we're not going to keep you. We just want to call you and tell you we love you. Well, I love y'all too, and, and I'm, I hope that all is well up there. Oh, yeah, it is. Well, With us. And... We just wanted to uh, talk to Bibi today, so I wanted to talk to you. Well, I'm, I'm really appreciate your call. I mean, it's a, that's nice of you. Yeah. Well, we love you. And I love you. I love both you guys. Okay. Well, thank you. And we hope you continue with your progress. And uh, well, I, you know, like I say, medically they they tell me that everything's functioning as it should. Well, that's great. That's. And I'm real happy. I mean, I don't. I don't, I don't, I don't care. My, people have been taking care of me up here has been wonderful, so yeah. I sure have no complaint about that. Maybe we'll get to see you sometime later well, Later on. If I do get out of here Friday, the next time we all get together, uh, I'll be there. Well, good. Yeah. All right, wrong information. I'd love to see y'all. Well, us too, and we're going to go, and um, and we love you, and, and we'll be we'll be checking on you. Well, thank you all for calling, okay? Okay. All right, we love you, man. I love you too, Mark. All right, bye. Bye. Goodbye.